Pat Love back from Love Healing Hearts doing the second part of Priscilla's End Time Dreams. Wow. Okay, here we go. Now I'm going to continue on. Two days ago, I saw earthquakes and, a, and tsunamis. Water was everywhere. People are running for their lives. I, it's just chaos. No one could save their lives easily. Water's I mean, water, bodies of water were everywhere, buildings shaking and out of, they were driven out of their places. I saw a little baby, seemed like a premature baby, in the basket. The mother had ran away for her life, leaving her child. No one seemed to care about the little baby. Well, I, I just ran over. I grabbed that baby. I grabbed the basket and held the basket to save the baby. The baby's height was just about the length of my palm. I managed to come out of the waters and the terror. Oh, my goodness. The terror, the terror, the terror. You guys, you just can't imagine. I was so glad that dream ended, but that's where it ended of all places. Weird, huh? Okay, so these are the dreams. I mean, I, I tell you, it is so scary to understand how these dreams are going. But these dreams, some of them may come from all of the stuff going on in the air and the internet, in the airwaves. I don't know. But guess what? I'm not taking any chances. I'm going to make sure that when Jesus comes, I'm already ready. I'm not going to play games with him. I'm not going to be in the bed with Tom, Dick, or Harry. If I have to be single and alone for the rest of my life so I can be ready, I can do without all that other stuff. But I cannot do without my God. And neither can you.